you're unsure of what price to do for merch by Amazon. So this is a subject that I really like. I have literally posted up over 10,000 shirts. I've had the ability to really test a wide variety of price ranges. And when merch was earlier on, it was actually okay to invest at about, I mean, to not invest, but to price it at about $22.99 and get that huge margin. And they actually reduced royalties by 30%, but it used to be like over $10 for $22.99. And that was beautiful. And at that time, it wasn't so saturated, so you could do that. Now, I want you to know that there's a big difference between if you have a great design, a unique paid for design, you can charge more, but just know that it might not sell. Like it's really a tricky game and you really have to play around a lot. So this is my personal formula. In a niche, for example, let's say lanterns, let's say that there's only a total of a thousand shirts for a variety of keywords. Well, if the average shirt is about $19.99, then yeah, you can go ahead and price some and like a lot are selling, then you can price it at $22.99 because perception is all that matters. And so if people perceive that shirt as being better for its graphics design, they're gonna perceive the value to be worth a lot more. And so it is okay to price it at $22.99. Now let's say there's a lot of people selling at $16.95, $17.95, in general, if that's the case, I will never go above $19.99. Like that would be that I would actually do $19.97, something like that. Um, and I would price it at that. I wouldn't go to the 22 range. But what I've tested, and I've tested, like I have a lot of shirts up. And what I've found is that in general, let's say the I Love Lanterns and Lanterns is something that is around $16.95. Well, in general, you really don't want to price it past maybe $17.95. And if you're at a smaller tier, I would even say fight it and price it at $15.95. I know this is a really trippy to tri tricky topic and a lot of people might get hurt on this, but do what's best for you. And so if you're at that lower tier, do it at $15.95. If you feel like there's a, a reason that you can price it at more because your design just stands out and it looks great, and honestly, that thumbnail that people see is really all that matters because that is what locks their eye locks onto. So if you know how to make catchy designs that will look great on a thumbnail, then you have an upper hand and you can really kill it in Merch by Amazon. And so to sum it up, my favorite price range is actually $16.95. So that's a little secret. Um, and I've tested this across a lot of shirts and it's my sweet spot that I really enjoy. I know some people don't like that, but um, I, to give an example, I uploaded around 3,000 shirts at 19.99, and this is actually recent. This is in 2018, and then I uploaded a bunch of shirts at 16.95. Guess which ones sold more? And I realized that it really depends on the niche, but you have to, there's a lot of manual work involved if you want to like get into the niche of like, I love a lantern, right? I love lanterns. Yeah, a certain niche is a certain price at certain points, but in general, I don't want to mess with that. I just upload it at $16.95. That's the price that I currently do. It's around $3 profit if I'm correct. And it's just something that I really recommend, especially when you're starting out, like you want to price low because you really just want to generate sales to get boosted to the next tier. So I hope that helps. If you really like this video and you like the information on it, please subscribe, like, comment, and share. I'd really appreciate that. And comment and, and share if you have any questions or you want me to do a video describing and discussing and giving knowledge on a certain topic that you're stuck on because I really do want to help and I really do want to see other people make success on Merch by Amazon. Thank you.